change your mind? Oh. Yes, yes, of course. Come back when you are one. Ah, ready? You are the best thing that ever happened to Jan. Well, maybe my first one. Ah, who am I kidding? It's you! Ah, oh, we're seriously going to help this moron out again? What on earth for? Time for work then. Um, it was Riley. Yes, 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 Riley. I have things for you. Distractions in Neon, so I expect you to be on your best behavior here. to stick my hands in fish guts all day. It's nice seeing new faces. Hey, Riley. Oh no, new coordinates. I am so clumsy. I'm up for doing this again. Bye. If I have to eat one more tube of troll for lunch, I'm going to keep. Interested in.
While we're here, you might want to stay away from the edge of the upper platform. It's a long way down. Nisa, better get out while we still... Oh, God! Get out! We're dying for this shit! I have things for you. Glad you could use a drink. Ah, wonderful! Super A plus, partner. We keep up like this, and we will both be living very large. Uh, Yannick could always use more. Our clients are so eager. <laughs> they do say the hardest part is showing up. I gotta I've tell you, man. of valuable tech disappearing from Genodyne to justify all the scrutiny of their own employees.
Don't shoot. If you want the encryption cipher, you're, you're welcome to it. There's no need for all this violence. <laughs> Look, there's no need to be angry with me. I I'm on your side. I I'm not trying to trick you. You want the cipher? It it's yours. At this point, I'd do anything to get back at my brother. He deserves everything he's got coming to him. I think you could safely say that most of Neon would agree. You know, I've spent my entire life living in Ben's shadow. Everything always works out for him. While, while I've been bouncing from one job to the next, barely keeping afloat. And all the while, he laughs at me behind my back. Thinks it's hilarious to make fun of his, his stupid brother. Like I wouldn't eventually find out. Yeah. That would be nice. You know what? I am sick to death of being pushed around. It's my turn to take control for once. The passcode for my terminal is GEN-41A18. That should give you access to the cipher and whatever else you need. I'm getting out of here while I still can. After you're done, I suggest you do the same. On a scale of one to 10, one being the worst, I'm at about, I don't know, a negative eight. I don't have the background for this electrical engineering stuff. Chief technician? It's, it's ridiculous. Ben stuck me down here, expecting me to work miracles. He didn't stop for even a second to think of the repercussions. That's so typical. All I need is one breakthrough. One. And I could shove this job right in his face. Damn, that would feel good. I really wish I could believe that. Fortunately, you have far more faith in me than I have in myself. Oh well, I'll think of something. Eventually. All I have is what? The rest of my life? As usual, you can thank my dear brother for that. At first, he made me deputy administrator. That went well until I wouldn't cooperate with Owen Dexler and all of his thugs at Neon Security. Then he had me work with Valentina over at Xenofresh, helping with Aurora distribution, until she pinned a credit skimming scam on me. And now, here I am, chief technician at Jenardyne, and I don't even know the first thing about electrical engineering. It feels good to be in control for a change. kept you. I believe we have a lot to discuss. It's obvious you're here to meet someone. Fortunately for them, they rented this VIP room under a false name. I assume that same someone provided you with that clever little virus you installed into Genodyne systems.
all too well. You know, I should give credit where it's due. That virus is quite impressive. It will cost me tens of thousands of credits to remove. That's the last time I'll ever take the Crimson Fleet's capabilities for granted. Probably. But do you want to know why that's not going to happen? It's because I don't negotiate with pirates. They don't understand commitments or contracts. How to get the deal done with finesse. No. For your kind, it's only brute force and violence. Shoot first, take whatever you want, and ask questions later. That's not how I do business. It may seem that way, but for every rival I've had thrown into the ocean, I've made two times as many legitimate deals. Look, I'm not here to debate. I'm here to make an offer. All you have to do is tell me who's profiting from the virus you've uploaded. In return, I'll let you leave the city alive. You make my skin crawl, do you? Brayson? Interesting. And here I thought my dear brother was simply a coward. Hmm. Perhaps I've misjudged Brayson. No matter. I'll deal with him soon enough. I would urge you to use compassion on Brayson's behalf. But that word isn't in your repertoire, is it, Bayou? So, I assume this concludes our little arrangement, and you'll be leaving our fair city. Oh, when you get back to the Key, be certain to give Neva and Delgado my warmest regard.